The proposed conditional exit offer for HMC's delisting is $0.048 per offer share. OUE Healthcare OUH, the parent company of OUEH Investments, which holds more than 50% of Healthway Medical Corporation's HMC shares. Detailed its rationale for seeking the letters delisting from the Singapore Exchange Securities Trading Limited SGXST. In an exit offer letter issued by OUE Healthcare on September 5th, the company said HMC's delisting is a milestone step to build a regional healthcare ecosystem. OUEH's current regional healthcare ecosystem and ship between our two nations will reach its zenith under your leadership. Mr. Hazen, a legendary figure in the Indian film industry, boasts a career that has spanned more than six decades. His cinematic contributions have earned him international acclaim. And he is considered one of the greatest actors in the history of Indian cinema. Most of the Thespian's film work has been in Tamil, but he has also appeared in some Malayalam, Hindi, Telugu, Kannada, and Bengali films. Aside from acting, he has worked as a director, producer and in multiple technician roles, and his work has been lauded by eminent Hollywood directors like Quentin Tarantino and Ang Lee. On top of his cinematic achievements, Mr. Hazen is an active politician with his own Democratic Socialist Party, the Makalnidi Mayam or People's Justice Center. Mr. Hazen appears to be a keen observer of politics in Singapore. Prior to his party's founding, he said in 2017 that the Indian broadcast channels should play the national anthem at midnight every night like Singapore's national broadcaster. When he founded his party in 2018, he cited Singapore's founding Prime Minister Lee Kuan Yew's work and how he might have had it safe as Singapore is a smaller area. In 2021, Mr. Hazen's party proposed bringing in Singapore-like standards to mitigate the serious flooding issue in Tamil Nadu in a seven-point governance and economic agenda.